Hey, honey, I... Honey, what's the matter? Why are you crying? <sighs> it's okay. I came in here to start packing, but... What's the matter, honey? Tell me, what's wrong? Oh, oh, ah, ah. A big shout out to Nicole Game for suggesting this video. And a big hello to Isla and all the rest of our Little Monkey fans. We hope you love this video! The Ricardo family packed for Becky's wedding. I'm just a little bit sad. Sad? Why? Well, I guess I'm happy and a little bit sad. I just was thinking about when the kids were little, and now Becky's getting married. She's all grown up, and all the other kids, they're not babies anymore. Yeah, but everybody's gotta grow up, right honey? Yes, but don't you remember when Becky was born, how perfect she was? Congratulations! She's a beautiful baby girl. What are you gonna name her? Oh, hmm, honey, we never did pick a name, did we? What about Rebecca Ann? Hmm, Rebecca Ann Ricardo. Yeah, I really like that name. We can call her Becky for short. Hmm, Becky Ricardo, I really like that. Congratulations again! Just look at her, Rick. Isn't she the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? Yes, yeah, she's so beautiful. Hello, my little Becky. Say hi to your dad. Yeah, that was a long time ago. Going on 21 years now. Yes. Your hair was a lot longer then. <laughs> yes, it was. Becky getting married, it's a good thing. I know, sweetie. It's just hard sometimes. Our babies are growing up. Yes, they are, but they'll always be our babies, right? Most definitely. I'm okay now. I guess we better keep packing. We don't want to miss our flight. Hey, Mom. Dad. Oh, hi, Becky. Mom, are you okay? You look like you've been crying. Oh, everything is fine, sweetie. Yeah, your mom's okay. She's just going down memory lane a little bit. I was just thinking about when you and Marcel were little and, you know, and then the twins came along and just remembering some of the good times we had. Hey, Mom. Dad. Do you know where my suitcase is? Oh, what's going on in here? Oh, nothing, Marcel. I was just thinking about when you guys were little and <laughs> all the funny stories. Oh, really? Like what? What funny stories? Well, Marcel, when you were a wee little baby and we first brought you home, Becky kept sneaking into your room to hold you. What? I did? I don't remember that. Hi, little baby Marcel. I'm your big sister, Becky. Oh, you're so cute. I'm not really supposed to be in here, but I just really wanted to see you and meet you. Go, 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 go. Do you want your big sister to hold you? Go, 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 go. Okay. Oh, you're kind of, kind of big, Marcel. I didn't think you would be this big. Go, 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 go. Oh, I love you too, Marcel. Good morning, Mar, Becky. What are you doing in here? Hi, Mom. And how did you get Marcel out of his crib? Oh, well, it was kind of tricky, but I, I got him. I'm sorry, Mom. I know you don't want me to be in here. Oh, honey. It's not that I don't want you to be with Marcel. It's just that I was trying to let him nap a little bit. And I didn't want either of you to get hurt if you tried to take him out of his crib. I got him, Mom. I see that. I just really wanted to see him, Mommy. Look at him. He's so cute. Yes, he certainly is. It's hard for me to believe that you used to be that size. Aw, oh, I was this small and cute? Yep, you're not that small anymore, but you're still cute. Cuckoo caca! Oh, now I remember. Yeah, it was because I thought you were so cute and I just really wanted to hold you. And Mom was always scared that I was going to drop you. Oh, well thanks Mom for trying to protect me. <laughs> oh, anyways, Marcel, yes, your suitcase should be in your closet, sweetie. Awesome, thanks Mom. Sorry, Becky, you came in here looking for something? I just need something to put my wedding dress in. I only have the bag that it came in and I'm scared that it's gonna get ripped and then the dress will be ruined. We have the really big suitcase. Your father can help you with that. Yep, I sure can, sweetie. That's great. I'm so scared something's gonna happen to it. Don't worry, sweetie, it'll be okay. Mom, mom, mom. What is it, Jasmine? Mom, mom. All right, you two, what's going on? Johnny said I'm not allowed to bring any books. That's not true. I just said you weren't allowed to bring that many books. 
Okay, what's going on? Jasmine wants to bring like 20. Well, but I love them all. And I can't go swimming like you, so I need something to do. Jasmine, you can bring five books to read and then maybe a coloring book. Sound good? Okay, sounds good, Mom. Hey, what's everybody doing in here? Oh, we're just packing and just remembering when you guys were all little. Oh, really? Like a story? Yeah! Tell us a story about when we were little. Hmm. Well, we can tell you about when your grandmother came to stay with us. I thought Grandma came to live with us because Grandpa died. Yeah, and she was all alone? Well, sort of, but she originally came after you two were born. And then she just hasn't really left. Really? Grandma stayed because of us? Well, I think Grandma stayed because of all of us, and I was very thankful to have the help. Having two babies at the same time is a lot of work, and I was really tired. Welcome home, everybody! Are you guys excited to move into our new house? I know I am, honey. Yeah, me too, Dad. Well, I guess it's okay. Marcel, what's wrong? Aren't you excited for a brand new house? I guess so, but I'm gonna miss all my friends. Don't worry, Marcel, you're gonna make new friends. But I like my old friends. Well, we don't live that far away. You can still call them. Yeah, I guess so. Come on, Marcel, let's go pick our new bedrooms. Ooh, okay, cool. How are you feeling, honey? Not too bad. A little bit tired, though. Well, that's to be expected when you're carrying twins. Oh, twins, don't remind me. How are we gonna do it, honey? We can handle it. We've already got two kids. What's two more, right? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Two babies all at once, that's a lot. We'll be okay. Oh, cool, it's got a pool. See, Marcel, this is gonna be a great house. Why do we have to move here anyways, Becky? Because mom's pregnant. Yeah, so? We were fine in our old house. Marcel, mom's carrying twins. That means two more babies. There just wasn't enough room in the old house. I guess this house is a lot bigger. Come on, Marcel, last one upstairs is a rotten egg. Cool, look at all the room up here. Yeah, totally, Marcel. Check out that huge bathroom, too. I'm gonna take this room here, and then you can have that room down there. Aw, oh, cool, okay. Let's go tell mom and dad that we picked our rooms. I think this will be the perfect house for us to expand our family. Honey, what are you doing? You shouldn't be carrying that, it's too heavy for you. Oh, it's okay, dear. Feels good to get a little bit of exercise. Yeah, but the doctor said you gotta take it easy. This suitcase isn't too heavy. Our master bedroom here should have enough room to keep the twins in here for the first little while, hey? Yes, I agree. Mom! Mom! Dad! Guess what? What is it, Marcel? Becky and I picked out our rooms! That's fantastic! Yeah! Becky gets the one at the top of the stairs and I get the one all the way on the left! But wait, where are the twins gonna sleep? We're gonna keep them in the master bedroom with us for a little bit. Just makes it easier since there's two of them. That way I don't have to go so far to feed them in the middle of the night and then to change their diapers. Wow, Mom. That's a lot of work. Yes, Marcel, it will be. But I did it with you guys, so, so I'm sure I can do it with the twins. Oh, that reminds me, honey. I talked to my mom, and she said she could come stay with us for a little bit while we're adjusting to having the twins around. Oh, really? She'd do that? Yeah, she said she could stay for a couple months just until we get settled. Oh, that'll be such a relief to know that I'll have a little bit of help around here. Hey, I help. You know what I mean. You're going to be at work during the day. And you have me, Mom. Of course I do, buddy. You'll be my little helper, right? You bet. I can't wait to meet my new brothers. Or sisters, I guess. Yeah, we won't know until I have the baby what they are, right? Both boys. Boys, both girls, one boy, one girl. Hmm, I hope that it's a boy and a girl, and then we'll have even numbers, two boys and two girls. Oh, that would be pretty perfect, hey? Yep. All right, come on, Marcel, you can help me unload the truck. Cool, I can drive the truck? Uh, no, I said you could help me unload the truck. Oh, well, okay, I can do that too. I'll go get Becky. Becky! That was really nice of your mom to offer to come help and stay with us. Yeah, she said she could probably manage about two months. Oh, that'll be so nice. Mom, I'm gonna go make sure Marcel doesn't hurt himself trying to unload the truck. Wait, you mean Marcel didn't want to move in here? We love this house. This house is awesome. It was just new for him and he wasn't used to it yet. Sometimes it takes a little while to get used to new things. But he has grown to love it, just like all of us. Hang on, Mom. You said this was when Grandma was moving in. She wasn't there yet. Nope, she wasn't. But we had to move into the new house first before she could come and stay with us. Otherwise, we wouldn't have had room at all. And just as we had got settled into the new house, guess who arrived? You two. Woohoo! Faster, Becky, faster! Becky, 
someone's at the door. Oh, it's Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Hi, Becky, dear. How are you guys doing? We're doing fine, Grandma. The house is lovely. I'm so happy that I came for a visit. We are too, Grandma. How long are you staying for? Maybe a couple months, just to help your mom and dad get settled with the new babies. Having twins is a hard thing to do. I hope you two are helping out. We sure are, Grandma. Where's your father? Oh, Dad's at work. And where's your mom? <coughs> Oh dear, Grandma came just in time. I'm gonna go help your mother. Why don't you two run upstairs and try to be a little bit quiet? Maybe your mom and I can put the babies to sleep. Okay, Grandma. Come on, Marcel. Let's go play upstairs. Okay, Becky. See you later, Grandma. See you later, Marcel. It's okay, you two. It's okay, Johnny and Jasmine. Mom's got some food for you. <laughs> Just gotta get you two fed at the same time here. It's a little bit tricky. Lucy, honey. Oh, Judy, I thought I heard the doorbell. How was your flight? Oh, it was just fine, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. Here, why don't you give me one of those beautiful babies? Oh, it's all right, Judy. I, I can do this. Well, I came here to help you. So here, let me help you, all right? I'll take Jasmine. Come on, sweetie. Come with Grandma. There now. You feed Johnny and I'll feed Jasmine. And then after they've had their lunch, we can put them down for a sleep and you can have a little nap too. Oh, but I should really get things started for dinner. Don't worry, sweetie. I'll cook dinner tonight. Thank you so much, Judy. You're a lifesaver. Oh, what are grandmothers for? Come on, Jasmine, dear. Hmm, where should we sit, sweetie? Oh, you know what? It's a beautiful day. Let's go sit outside. Here we go, sweetie. I sit by the pool. Such a beautiful day. There we go. Time for your lunch. That's a good girl. Oh my goodness. It's a lot warmer here than Grandma was expecting. Grandma doesn't usually get nice weather like this at her house. Oh, and the sun is so bright. Oh, I'll just borrow your mom's sunglasses. Oh, much better. Hmm. I kind of like these, but I think Grandma's going to have to wear some cooler clothes. I'm kind of hot. Cool, cool, da, 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 da. Oh, you're such a sweet girl. Booja, 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 boo. All right, sweetie. Time for bed. There. All right, honey. Jasmine's down. Why don't you give me Johnny and you can go have a little lie down too. Oh, that's all right. I can finish. No, no. Grandma's here. Here, you can give me Johnny and you go lay down. He ate all of his bottle. He just needs to be burped. Sounds good, dear. Here we go, Johnny, dear. Come on, let's get a little burp out of you. Oh, dear. Oh, what is it? Nothing, sweetie. Johnny just got a little bit sick on me. Oh my goodness. Here, I'll take him. Thanks, honey. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry, Judy. Your beautiful coat. That's okay, dear. It'll come right out. I think I'm gonna go change anyways. I was getting a little bit hot. All right, I'll put Johnny down. All right, then after you do, you go take that nap, okay? Oh dear. Go, 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 key. Oh good, Lucy and the kids are sleeping. Hmm, still have some time before dinner. Maybe I'll go sit by the pool. I'll be much cooler in my bathing suit. I think I'm gonna like it here. And I don't think your grandmother's ever worn pants again since that day. <laughs> that's kind of funny. I like having grandma around. Yeah, me too. We all do, kids. Okay, Johnny Jasmine, come on. Dad'll help you finish packing. Don't forget, Dad. Mom says I get ten bucks. No, your mother said five. Nice try, though. Oh, man. Thank you, honey. No problem, dear. All right, you guys, come on. We gotta finish packing. The shuttle for the airport's gonna be here soon. I know, dear. I know, Dad. Well, honey, it's getting to be close to your big day. How are you feeling? Um, a little nervous, but excited. I kind of have butterflies in my stomach, just like the day I first met Jason. Hmm, nice house. Pizza's here! 
I'll get it, Dad. Hello. Hi. Oh, uh, uh, I'm Pam. I mean, I'm from Pam's Pizza Palace. My name is Jason. Oh, I'm Rebecca. And now I can't believe that we're getting married. I know, sweetie, I'm so excited for the two of you. But if we don't finish packing, you won't be getting married at all because we're going to miss our plane. And we got to get to the airport. Oh my gosh, Mom, you're right. Okay, I'm going to go and finish packing right now. Come on, everyone, the shuttle's here. We gotta get going to the airport. We don't wanna miss our flight. I'm all ready to go, Dad. That's good, son. <laughs> I've got your bag, Jasmine, so don't worry about it. Aw, oh, thanks, Dad. Hey, Dad, I'm all ready to go, too. Now we just need the ladies. Okay, honey, I'm all set. Whoa, Becky, your bag is huge. You know we're only going for a week, right? Ha ha ha, Jasmine. I have to fit my big dress and all my other clothes too. Oh, right. Dad, is there going to be room in the shuttle for all of us and Becky's bag? Don't worry, Jasmine. We got the big van coming. Oh, okay, great. No, oh, we just need Mom. Come on, Mom! The shuttle's here! Oh, don't worry, Ricky. I'm here. Uh, Mom, don't you want to change, maybe? You're still wearing your bikini. You know we're going on the airplane, right? There's no pool on the airplane? Oh, I know, honey, but we're going to the beach resort anyway, so I thought, why bother changing? I have my beautiful stole that you guys gave me for my birthday, though, just in case it gets chilly on the plane. Oh, dear. All right, guys, the shuttle's waiting. Come on, let's get going. To the airport. The end. Flying we will go, flying we will go. Hi, ho, the Dario, a flying we will go. Oh, Dad. Thanks for watching. To join all the fun up in our treetop, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go banana!